And I think with our higher spin jump... Whoa! <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Things are certainly starting to get very interesting now. And this is only the third level of the world. Let's explore around. Wow. What's this down there? Those are some interesting circles down there. Okay, lots of lava all around here. You can see that the lava is a square shape that just extends past these walls. Let's drop down to over there. Let's see if there's anything interesting over here. Today, we play through World Flower of Super Mario 3D World, except every time we complete a level, Rosalina's spin attack will have double jump height. So let's see what this is going to be like. Bounce up here. I could just use the spin jump to get up higher. Oh no! Oh! <laughs> okay, good, we got the star. Nice, just barely got that star there. All right, let's see how much spinning is going to help here. Maybe not much. Whoa, that side flip! Oh! <laughs> Looks like I accidentally also doubled Rosalina's side flip. Let me fix that. I am not used to going this high after doing Rosalina's spin jump. And I don't even play as Rosalina much. Oh, man. This is actually so useful. If you're ever in a situation where you're going to fall down, you could just... Almost always use that spin jump for a nice boost. Just get a mushroom from over here. There you go. Let's bounce on up here. Oh, green coins. Oh, I forgot how high up that brings me. Oh! No! Couldn't make it. Oh, man! Wait a minute. Can we jump over here? Ah! Okay, this time... Is that... Wow, that's not only a cat bell, but a lucky cat bell. Oh, wait a minute! When you're a cat, you don't have your spin attack. Okay, so let me get damaged then. So we can keep going like this. So much easier to do that than to take all the enemies. Just kind of funny. But I wonder if you can get up here. Oh no, there's an invisible ceiling, of course, there. Yeah, they, it wouldn't make sense that they'd want you to jump up over the level, so it's nice that there's a ceiling that pushes you down there. Can we make it across to there? I don't think we can make it across to there right now. There's no way we can make it across to there without the pipe. Maybe later on when our jump is higher, we'd be able to make it all the way across like that. We can jump up pretty high. Yeah, can reach the top of the flag from here. That's quite nice. Okay, a level is complete, so that means it is time to double Rosalina's jump height. Okay, World Flower Dash 2, Floating Fuzzy Time Mine. I'm ex- Whoa! I was gonna say I'm expecting this to be easier, but <laughs> I don't even know where I'm going to go when I jump. Okay, so we have to avoid these fuzzies. It doesn't really feel like there's as much of a sense of urgency in this level with these fuzzies chasing you because if you just jump up, you could float pretty high above the level. Now those fuzzies are coming from the side there. Uh-oh. Will we be able to go across fast enough? Wait, where am I? The fuzzies disappeared! Where did the fuzzies all go? <laughs> Is it because I jumped so far up that I reached an area where I triggered some other fuzzies? Where am I? Where am I? I don't know where I am. Why are the fuzzy? Oh, I'm right here. Oh no. The fuzzies are going to catch up to me and the camera is still stuck here. Look at this, this isn't fair. <laughs> the fuzzies are going to catch up to me, this is wild. Okay, there we go. Now it's starting to become a bit more normal. There we go. Oh, now there are some fuzzies coming from over there. Oh! I thought that would be the end of the level. What if we jump over the fuzzies? Oh no! They don't even come for me anymore. Can I jump past the fuzzies that way? Ah, oh, they fill up that whole area! 
Yeah, and there's a pretty low ceiling over here. You can't jump very high over here. But, whoa, 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 whoa. I was gonna say, but we can jump into the flag, but that was some very quick movement there from Rosalina. Okay, but she's not jumping high enough from her spin attack, so let's double it again. Okay, World Flower Dash 3, Piranha Creeper Creek After Dark. And I think with our higher spin jump, whoa, <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Things are certainly starting to get very interesting now. And this is only the third level of the world. Let's explore around. Wow. <laughs> Some of these shapes are in the background are very crude. Oh, the ceiling here is pretty low. Oh, the ceiling here isn't low, whoa. Hopefully I fall back to the level. Where's the level? There's the level. All right, doing pretty good here, making our way through the level. Anything interesting in here? Ah, oh, but with a fire flower, you can't do that other jump. Okay, so is there anything that will damage us but not kill us immediately? I think this fits the bill. It's pretty cool. Now let's jump up here. I love that there are no ceilings in this room here. You can go so high. Let's go into that pipe over there. Oh man, I almost fell, so I had to panic and use this spin attack so that we could safely make it to here. Where's the... There we go. And that's where we wanted to get. Let's go down this pipe. Oh, that just brings you back here. Okay, I thought that'd bring us somewhere else. But go across this way. Wow, that's so... Oh, I wonder if we can get onto that thing in the background there. Let's see. Whoa! Oh, the camera doesn't... Oh, and you die. There's a death area there that stops you. Okay, so let's see. Can we jump all the way across? Can we make it all the way to the end? I don't think so. We could almost make it to the end, but you fall pretty quickly. Okay. It's so funny seeing the things sticking out of the levels there. Well, hold on. Right now we just see Sky. Uh, okay. Nice. Ah, got me. Is there a mushroom in here, maybe? No mushrooms here? That's too bad. Let's see if there's anything up here. Wow, there's a very low ceiling that pushes you down. We can't jump as high in this room. Oh, they put a ceiling here. This just makes this more difficult. Okay, well, there's the end of the level, so... There we go! All right, cleared another level. Very nice. This is so easy so far. This is amazing. I like this a lot. So we're done one more level, so let's double Rosalina's spin, attack, jump again. Okay, the next world is World Flower Dash 4, Fort Fire Bros. Oh, faster Fort Fire Bros. Okay. World Flower Dash 4, faster Fort Fire Rose. We only have 30 seconds, oh my goodness. What are we going to do here? If we jump up, will we be able to make it to the flag in time? I don't know if we're going to come down in time. Let's do some dives here. What's this down there? Those are some interesting circles down there. Okay, lots of lava all around here. You can see that the lava is a square shape that just extends past these walls. Let's drop down to over there. Let's see if there's anything interesting over here. What could this- Oh! Time is running out already, oh man! Wow, you really don't have a lot of time in this level. You've really gotta, really gotta go fast, as they say. Oh. Where's some more time? We need more time. More time, please, no! I was hoping that we could just jump through a lot of the level, but it looks like we actually have to go around and collect some of this time. You know what? This is actually so useful because we have this one tool at our disposal for a super high jump. But also, if we just want to do regular jumps like this, that's fine. So this is probably going to be easier than some of my challenges where, whoops. Uh, hopefully this is going to be easier than my challenges where we double jump height after every level. I'm honestly expecting this to be easier because if you just want to do a regular jump, then that's fine, then you can just do a regular jump. But if you want to do a crazy high jump, you could do that too. Where are you supposed to go next? Oh, over there? Ha! Huh. 
You think I need this pipe to go there? Pathetic. I don't need pipes. I'm Rosalina. Oh, maybe I do need the pipe. I'm running out of time. No, I need the pipe. I'm sorry, pipe. Very nice. Ah, uh, no, I still don't want to use the pipe if I don't have to. Hopefully I don't have to. Okay, there's the end of the level. Just gotta make it over to the flag, just make it over to the flag! Five, four, three, two, one! Oh my goodness! With zero seconds left, we grabbed the flag! That was so clutch! Oh my goodness, I didn't know that you could complete the level with zero seconds left! I'm not even gonna go for the 10,000 point pull grab because that was too good. World Flower Dash 6, Shiftier, Boom Mansion. And we're gonna be able to jump pretty high. I'm expecting there to be a lot of ceilings here, so we probably can't get very high. How about here? How's the ceiling here? Oh, there's still a ceiling here! Even though we're outside, there's still an invisible ceiling here. That's kind of funny. And a bit unexpected. Whoa! Hello there, ghosts. It doesn't look like there's anywhere to go over there. Oh! Man, that ceiling is pretty low. I don't think our super high jump height really helps us out much here. Oh, maybe over here it will. Okay, it doesn't help a lot, but at least the ceiling's a bit higher here. If only we could float like Princess Peach, that would be so useful here. Let's just pop in here. Is there an invisible ceiling over here? Of course. There's so many invisible ceilings here. I'm surprised at how many invisible ceilings are in this level here. Okay, this one is also a fake, right? I think this one's also fake. Yeah, that one's also a fake flag. There's a warp box over there, though. What's over this way? Okay! Let's just come back down. So, over here, there's no invisible ceiling. So, Rosalina can jump up really high here. Oh, it's starting to get blurry now. Okay, there we go. The sky is back. Okay, so that means that we should be coming down. Hopefully, we drop back down on the level and not somewhere out of bounds and die. Okay, now some fog is back, okay. It was nice that we got to see that building in the background pretty clearly. But now I hope that Rosalina comes back down soon. I've been grand panic- Oh! Thank goodness we made it back to here. Let's just jump along over here. Head into this warp box right here. Oh, and up here there's also no ceilings here. So we could go pretty high. Get a nice view of everything over here. These towers up here. You can see that they're partially empty. Right there, that's really interesting. So normally you can't get up this high, so you wouldn't be able to see that those towers are empty from the top. But you can see that these towers are empty from the top when you jump up that high. There are a lot of things in this game that are out of bounds like that, that if you can't normally reach them or if you can't normally see them, then they aren't filled in like that. Whoops, I did that by accident. <laughs> you really have to get used to going so high when you do a spin jump like that. I might actually run out of time if I don't make it to the goal pole. There we go, but we made it to the goal pole, very nice. It's unbelievable how colorful this looks once you leave that level. Is this one flower seven? Flower five, wait a minute. Did I not do flower five? Oh, it looks like I skipped flower five. Okay, let's do flower five then. World flower dash five, sprawling Savannah rabbit run. Savannah or Savannah? I asked this last time and I'm not sure. I'm expecting there to not be invisible ceilings here. Yes, of course. We can jump up high into the clouds. We are high above the level. The level is nowhere below us to be seen. Oh, actually there's the level. I wonder if we could jump straight to the end of the level from here. Wow, so this is what it looks like with the level coming into view. It looks like such a weird color. Oh my goodness, it's only right when you get to the level that it starts to get its color back. Oh! And that conch door just disappears and comes into view when you're like this. That's actually really funny. Okay, I want to do this. Jump, spin jump, do a dive here, and let's see if we can complete the level in one jump. That'd be very nice if we could complete the level in a single jump. Oh, that's actually the flag! No! I was so close! It's funny, we're so far away from the level that you can't even see the floor of the level, so it's a bit hard to judge where you have to go to make it to the flag. Wow. 
All right, so that is the 10,000 point pull grab. So let's double Rosalina's jump height again and head to the next level. World Flower Dash 7 Pipeline Boom Lagoon. Anything interesting up here? Wow, look at all these clouds. Let's see, are there ceilings here? I think there might be a ceiling here. Yeah, there's a ceiling here. Okay, so you can't get over that. What about from over here? Okay, we can jump up to here. Wow, and up here, there are invisible ceilings up here. So you can see that Rosalina gets pushed down over here, so we can't head up to there. That's interesting that we can't head up there. Now let's see, is there going to be a ceiling here? Nope, no ceiling here. You could jump up very high in this room. Okay, but you come down pretty quickly after that. Okay, hopefully we have enough time. No! I wanted to jump up. I wanted to jump up and do a spin jump and then a ground pound right away. I was going to say, hopefully we have enough time to come down to the flag. But instead, I just ended up grabbing the bottom of the flag. Okay, so let's double this again. Oh man, what in the world is this level going to be? World Flower Dash 8 Blast Block Skyway. Oh, this might not be too bad at- Oh man, where's the level? All we see is shooting stars. Oh, there we go, finally, the level's coming. Okay, there's the level. All right, let's head down there. Wait, am I skipping past a part of the level or something? Okay, oh sure, there's the checkpoint flag. You know what, I'll go for the checkpoint flag. Where am I though? Oh! Okay, I made it to a checkpoint flag. Okay, sure, that's one way of making it to the checkpoint flag. Very nice. Now let's just drop down. The end of the level. That took a very long time to come down. All I did was a jump and then the spin attack and I pressed the ground pound button immediately after that and it took so long to fall. I didn't even use the full height of the spin attack. If we use the full height of the spin attack, I don't think we'll have time to come down. Okay, here's the level, here's the level. We're getting to the level. Now where's the goal pole? That is the question. Let's see, is the goal pole down here? It's gotta be down there somewhere. Time is running low, okay. And there we go, right onto the goal pole. Such a nice way to finish the level. We didn't get to see much of the level. We floated above a lot of the level, but that's another level completed. World Flower Dash 9, Towering Sunshine Seaside is next. All right, let's see what's... Oh man, that is fast. I don't think we're even going to come down in time, even if we ground pound. I did a ground pound right away, and I don't know if that's going to be fast enough to get us down in time. Yep, still coming down. The level's nowhere to be seen. Got a nice sunset in the background there. Got some nice clouds, some nice sunshine here, but it looks like we're not going to be able to make it to the level in time. Even if you ground pound immediately after doing Rosalina's spin attack like that, you just go too high. You're not able to make it back down to the level. <laughs> I tried to do a spin attack into the Goomba stack, but I just disappeared. And these Goombas are all here in disbelief. These Goombas are just like, where in the world did Rosalina go? She was just here. There we go. How nice is this? We have the Fire Bro helping us out. The Fire Bro over there wants to take out all of these Goombas here. Very helpful. Too bad there isn't enough time. Oh, will the Fire Bro be defeated? Ah, oh, there's not enough time for the Fire Bro to be defeated. So close. So close. Okay, there we go. We have defeated all of them. Okay, this warp box has now appeared. Let's not... No! I accidentally... I accidentally did Rosalina's spin attack. Now we're up high in the sky and we're not going to be able to make it down in time. No, I even defeated all the enemies. And of course, time is going to run out, so we have to do this again. It's a pretty nice scene here, though, with the warp box and the sunset in the background. Be very, very careful not to accidentally do Rosalina's attack while she's in the air. Let's just carefully make our way over to that cube. Very, very carefully. Okay, and into the box. Here we go. Here's the end of the level. Would you look at that? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared to do Rosalina's spin jump attack. Rosalina's spin attack is becoming too powerful. But since we've completed another level, it's time to double it again. 
Here's World Flower-10, Honeycomb Skyway. And this one is, uh, this one's an auto-scroller level, isn't it? What if we go up really high? Does the level keep auto-scrolling? What if we just stay still? Okay, I jumped up. We're still way back there. I wonder what's going to happen. We're just being taken through the level. We're just being shown a cinematic of what this level is like. Even though we are not here, the camera just goes through the level. Let's just see what's up ahead. Okay, and now all of a sudden the camera brings us over to here. The camera brought us all the way through the level, even though we are not in screen. We are somewhere far above the level right now, and far behind where the camera is. But the camera's just stuck over here because you have to defeat these three mini-bosses to continue. Oh! Oh, you can't actually defeat them. You can only make them dizzy by tapping them like this. I don't know what this is going to be like. I'm going to try doing the spin attack while in the air, and then I'm just going to do a dive right away to see if we come down or to see how high we go. Okay, so here we go. And that was right after doing the dive. I did the dive right after the spin attack, and we are way up here in the clouds. So we are now at the point where if you do Rosalina's spin attack in any level, you don't come down in time before the timer for the level runs out. Even if you do a ground pound right away, even if you do a dive right away, you just have too much vertical speed and you're up in the clouds like this the whole time. Let's see if we do it up here. I'm very curious to see if there's a ceiling up here or no. Nope, no ceiling up here, but the camera doesn't follow you up, so Rosalina's just gone here. Now you can just stare at these warp boxes until time runs out. That's what happens if you do it here. In my video where Luigi can jump higher every time you complete a level, or Princess Peach can float longer every time you complete a level, we were able to explore out-of-bounds areas in some levels. Since there are so many levels in World Flower, which is what we did in this video, compared to some other worlds in this game, that means that Rosalina is able to get up even higher and become even more uncontrollable much sooner. This eventually becomes a challenge where you can't use Rosalina's spin attack, because if you do, then you'll just float in the air until time runs out. So it's basically like you're playing as a regular character who can't do spin attacks. If you are interested in some more videos about testing what is possible in games, exploring out of bounds and inaccessible areas, or explaining how interesting game mechanics work, you might enjoy some of my other videos on my channel, and you're even welcome to click the subscribe button if you'd like to be notified when new videos come out. Wishing all of you a very fantastic day ahead of you, and take care everybody. Buddy.